What is up guys, welcome back to Dan's Reviews, and today I'm back for my weekly Walking Dead Q&A for this week. This one is number 5 now, leading up to the eventual release for the Walking Dead Season 10 uh, finale, which unfortunately we're still going to be waiting for for a little while. This one I want to talk about, and I want to start with the question, because I have been asked this question a lot, uh, ever since the break for some reason. Every once in a while, I've gotten this question by a couple different people, so I'm like, you know what, I'm just going to kind of answer everybody in this video. How do I think the Walking Dead is going to end? I'm just going to give a pretty brief kind of uh, explanation here for the beginning of this video how I think The Walking Dead is going to end just basically uh, just kind of quickly and then we'll also get into of course as usual your Q&A questions for this week's Walking Dead Q&A. Okay guys, so this is going to be doing my weekly Walking Dead Q&A for this week though. This one I want to discuss, of course, like I said, I've gotten this question a lot over the last couple weeks. A lot of uh, people asking me how I think The Walking Dead is going to end. Now, I've done previous videos on this, so I'm not going to go into detail that much, but I definitely will give an updated kind of uh, explanation on how do I think Walking Dead is going to end. Because the thing is, is that my vision on how The Walking Dead is going to end has changed from like seasons like 6, 7, 8 to season like 10, you know? Um... We've had characters leave, we've had uh, a lot of things go down, and a lot of things have changed, and my ideas have changed on how I think the show is going to end, you know? Um, I thought for sure that at least, at least Carl would make it till the end, and maybe Rick would die in the last season. Um, I did not think that actually both characters would not be involved in the show at all by the time we would get to season 10. Um, that is something I just did not think was going to happen. Now, um, that being said, that means the show is unpredictable and it's, it's very good at that, that type of deal. So that's, that's good. That's an advantage that the show has. But, the, you know, at the same time, you could have kept Carl. Andrew Lincoln left. So really, I'm sure they didn't plan it too much to have this kind of go down the way it is. So definitely it's a bit of a question mark on how is the show going to end. Now, for me personally, I always look at Judith now as kind of the next example of uh, who should really end the show. Um, and I'm going to go with that in this video. I think that the show will end with Judith. I think that the show will end with a huge time jump, just like the comics. I do. I, I truly do believe that the show will end uh, just like the comics, except remixed with other characters. You know, I think Daryl will be an old man. Uh, I think that uh, Carol will be super old. They're going to make them look older. Maybe even an older Negan if Negan survives till the end. Uh, and just, just a couple other characters. An older version of Eugene. Uh, maybe, I don't know, older version of a couple other characters. I don't think they're all going to survive till the end. But I think that those few there will at least survive. Um... And then I'm thinking that the show will end with Judith being at least like a 20, 30 year old, basically leading all the communities. And we have some kind of peaceful ending where the Commonwealth is, is chill. All the other communities are chill and everything is just kind of good. The zombies are dying out. You know, there's not as many zombies anymore because it's so many years after the apocalypse. Um, and they can kind of just live at peace now and kind of just have a, a normal life. That's what I'm thinking for the series finale. Uh, just briefly, just kind of my personal uh, thoughts on that. But I want to hear from you guys. Do you guys think that's how The Walking Dead is going to end? or do you have another idea? Do you think it'll be Game of Thrones where the ending absolutely sucks? You know, because, you know, Game of Thrones is a good example of a bad ending. If anybody's ever seen Game of Thrones, you know what I'm talking about. The ending of Game of Thrones is absolutely terrible. It's so bad that people literally don't even recommend the show anymore. And that's pretty bad. So, you know, let's hope The Walking Dead actually has a good ending and a better ending than Game of Thrones. Because, man, if Walking Dead is an ending anything close to Game of Thrones, people are going to hate hate it. They are going to hate the series, uh, at least probably part of it, at least, or whatever season uh, is the last they'll probably hate, just because there's a bad ending. So let's hope that Walking Dead does not have a Game of Thrones type ending, is that, and that we do actually get to see a very good ending for The Walking Dead, just like the comics. Because I feel like people were relatively happy with the way the comics ended. So, um... Yeah, that's just my thoughts on it. But yeah, write your comments in the comment section below. Now let's get into your guys' Q&A questions for this week's Walking Dead Q&A. First one comes from Brian Akeem, of course, which actually, by the way, let me uh, uh, shout out real quick before I get to your question. Uh, he is doing a live stream tonight, so if you guys want to actually come to his channel and check out the live stream tonight, I'm going to be in the chat tonight, uh, so you can just uh, you can talk with me in that. Uh, that's going to be a video tonight. Just search up Brian Akeem on YouTube, and uh, you know uh, you can actually uh, check out his live stream tonight, because I'd like to see as many people show up as, uh, as we can. Uh, we're going to be discussing the Walking Dead Telltale games tonight as well as probably the regular series as well. So that's going to be tonight. Um, 
8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So, yeah, uh, or 8.20 p.m., sorry, Eastern Standard Time. So, yeah, that's just a little bit of a shout-out just real quick. I uh, just want to let everybody know that. But, anyway, his question is, um, uh, so he thinks that uh, a, a Shane Pop does not exist. Uh, and he's pretty shocked about that, it sounds like. So, um, yes, uh, I will actually have to say uh, to Brian and Keem, uh, I'm going to surprise you and say there is a Shane Pop that exists. Uh, it does exist, and I will try to pull up a picture of it right here on the screen. There is a Shane Funko Pop, but it is an exclusive, and the price is out of this world. So that's why I don't have it. That's why I don't have it in my collection is because uh, the price of the Shane Pop is out of this world. It's absolutely insane. Um, maybe someday if the price goes down or something, I can get it. But yeah, uh, the Shane Pop um, right now I can't find for a very good price. Um, but there is a Shane Funko Pop out there. Like I said, I'll try to put up an image here on the screen for you guys. But there is a Shane uh, Funko Pop just for uh, for Brian if he's wondering. So yeah, really good question. And uh, yeah, I'm, I mean, I'm, I think uh, you know eventually we could definitely get the Shane Pop and review it on this channel. Uh, I just hope that the price goes down because I'm not going to order a pop for like a hundred dollars. That's just ridiculous. So um, you know, I love I love Funko Pops, but but not that much. You know, uh, not Shane. If you know, at least if it was like Rick or Daryl or something, at least it'd be kind of like I consider it maybe a little bit. But Shane, I don't know if I. I'd, I'd really feel like spending a hundred dollars on a Shane pop, but that's just my opinion. So anyway, um, write your comments in the comment section below about that one though. Thank you very much for the comment. Next one also comes from Ryan Akeem, and this one is a video suggestion, so we definitely will uh, uh, definitely uh, do this one, because uh, as many Walking Dead topics, guys, as I can uh, for the uh, for the break, because honestly, it sounds like we're not going to be seeing Walking Dead for a little while still. Um, so this one is uh, Top 10 Dead Characters They Should Have Kept Alive. Um, really good one. Top 10 Dead Characters That They Should Have Kept Alive. So uh, I'm going to ask you guys to hold off. I'm, I'm going to say don't put your list right now, because I'm going to do that video. I think that's a really good idea from Brian Akeem. Um, I think that'd be a really, really cool idea to do a... Uh, uh, top 10 uh, dead characters they should have kept. I already know what my number one spot is going to be, and I'm sure I'm sure Brian Akeem probably already knows his number one character they should have kept in the show. Uh, I know for sure uh, which one he uh, he has probably as, as his number one. But, um, yeah, I'm going to do that video coming up this week. Top 10 dead characters that they should have kept. Uh, probably mid next week. Uh, I still have a couple videos planned, too. I actually have uh, the CRM video I'm still working on right now, and a couple other videos as well. So we're going to do some Walking Dead videos this week, as well as uh, review episode two of the video game. And I'm also uh, doing, uh, I'm playing The Last of Us right now, which I'm also very, very interested in. Uh, so, uh, yes, I am playing The Last of Us right now as well, uh, as well as the Walking to Telltale games, you know, because I got pretty much a lot of time right now. Um, so yeah, uh, I'm playing Walk Dead uh, video game, I'm playing The Last of Us, and uh, you know, uh, we got some video suggestions for the main series this week, so you know, it should, it should be good, we should be good for videos this week, guys. Um, as well, uh, uh, as well, I am looking for a new TV show to get into. Uh, I would like to try to get into a new TV show, so if anybody has any uh, uh, um, uh, suggestions, uh, I would like to get into a new a new TV show, either something on Netflix, or just a, a series, uh, 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 just anything at all, um, that uh, a series that maybe you guys would want me to check out, and maybe I could even, you know, uh, review it with you guys because we gotta we gotta start watching something you know because uh, walking dead isn't on uh, the plague isn't on survival of the fittest is on but again that's only once a week I, i'd like to also find something else too to kind of uh, cover on the channel uh so if anybody has any uh, tv show recommendations um yeah, that'd be good to uh, post that in the comment section below as well. So yeah, thank you very much for the comment, Brian. And the last question for today comes from uh, Savage Boy. So uh, basically he says that he thinks, and this is a definitely a very, very big one. Uh, this one is, uh, he thinks that um, basically Carol's going to get comic Andrea's death and that Daryl will be the one to put her down. So, ouch. Yeah, um, you know, honestly for, uh, for Savage Boy, um, I could see it. I, I definitely could see it. I think... I, I feel like I'm in denial when I'm about to say this. I don't think it's going to happen because I feel like they need Melissa McBride. They need characters in the show. But, I mean, they've really made Carol's character hated this season. Are they doing that because they're trying to make her death easy? I don't know, honestly. That's, that's one where I'm in denial. I'm like, no, they're not going to kill Carol, but... I don't know, like, could could they? Like, I don't know, that that would be really, really tough to watch, especially if Daryl had to do it. And especially, they, they're not, ha like, Daryl's not really happy with her right now. Um, so that would definitely affect Daryl a lot. Um, I don't know, that's that's what I want to see you guys answer in the comment section, honestly. Do you guys think that uh, Carol's going to take Comic Andrea's death? And if you don't think it's her, do you think somebody else will take it, or they're just going to scrap that death? Because I don't see them scrapping that death, though, either. Um, I could see it either being Carol, or... I don't know. Maybe we should do a video this week talking about who do we think that's going to be. Because I do think that they will probably have that death happen. So maybe we'll do that video this week on uh, who do we think is going to take that death. Because I do think that they're either going to have that happen in the finale 
or early season 11. Um, or scrap it all together, which is also, you know, a possibility, I guess we should mention as well. But, um, yeah, interesting. Very, very interesting stuff. So, uh, really cool questions from you guys this week. Uh, and, of course, uh, some of the ones to pull from this week. Uh, you know, uh, Shane, of course, uh, there is a Shane Funko Pop out there. So, uh, does anybody out there have a Shane Funko Pop? Uh, and if so, uh, how much did you, uh, how much did you pay for it? Because me, I personally, I, I can't find it for a good price right now. Uh, I would love to have a Shane uh, Funko Pop, though, for the, uh, for the collection. Um... As well as, do you guys want me to review any uh, brand new TV shows? Or are there any TV shows out there you guys want me to watch? Because right now is the time to comment it down below. Uh, any suggestions, anything, um, I will check it out. And uh, we could do a, maybe a pilot review for this or that and the other thing. Uh, we really got to you know get into a few other things as well on the channel too, guys. Because even though there's going to be Walking Dead videos, and I am still going to do a good few a week, um, we got to still try to find other videos to do on other things. And I think right now is a good time for us to... Not just me, but also a few of you guys, too. You guys be like, you know, um, oh, well, this new TV show, you know, uh, check this out as well. Um, I think it's a good time to really get into some new stuff, and, uh, you know, I'm excited. Uh, playing The Last of Us right now, Walking Dead Telltale Games is going very good right now, and, uh, you know, uh, it's all it's all very good stuff, so very, uh, very, very excited. And then also, specifically, who do you think is going to take the uh, the comic Andrea uh, death in the TV series version, and how do you think the Walking Dead series is going to end? I want to hear that in the comment section below as well. So, yeah, guys, of course, if you're new here, click the subscribe button, so stay in my Walking Dead videos. Follow Dance, walking your reviews on Instagram, guys, and of course, I will see you guys, by the way, tomorrow for a uh, Simon, the good and bad of Simon, uh, that's going to be very good, that's going to be very exciting to do tomorrow, and of course, um, probably let's chit chat this Sunday is also another thing I want to update with you guys, I want to talk about a couple things uh, this Sunday, uh, and if you guys have any uh, TV show uh, suggestions, then maybe we can talk about what that's going to be uh, this Sunday, so uh, really cool stuff, guys, write your comments in the comment section below, and I'll see you guys really soon for some more Walking Dead videos, enjoy the rest of your day, guys, and peace out.